Dear friends, now we have a representative from India, Mr. Kishore Angole. Kishore Angole was born in Chennai, the south of India. He uh, got education at the university, the bachelor degree in commerce. Is the banker by profession and up to now is working in Mongolia as the manager of the state uh, of bank. Uh, he is a member of the Theosophic Society since 2009. Ishori regularly publishes articles on Theosophy and a monthly uh, journal. He's read over 90 lectures on the secret doctrine in his native language. And uh, uh, since November 2020 up to March 2021. So we have a very active philosopher who lives in India and we're happy to welcome him. Let's give him a round of applause. Uh, the Theosophic Society of India, uh, the Secret Doctrine and Hatha Yoga. Namaste everyone. Uh, the topic is the Secret Doctrine and the Agni Yoga. There is no religion higher than truth, the eternal uh, line of secret doctrine. Volume 1, Cosmogenesis, stanza 1st, 2nd and 3rd describes cosmos before creation. Stanza 4 describes the evolution of cosmos after creation. Volume 2, Anthropogenesis, evolution of man and his destiny. Science of Agni Yoga, Agni Yoga book series, 14 books, Leaves of Maurya's Garden number 1, Leaves of Maurya's Garden number 2, New Era Community, Science of Agni Yoga, Agni Yoga, Infinity number 1, Infinity number 2, Hierarchy, Heart, Fairy World number 1, Fairy World number 2, Fury World number three, Home, Brotherhood, Super Mundane. Total 14 books. We will see some points from each and every book. Leaves of Moria's Garden, I am. Your Bliss, I am. Your Smile, I am. Your Joy, I am. Your Rest. I am your strength. I am your wailer. I am your wisdom. You will hear our aspirations upon the peaks of the mountains. Leaves of Maurya's Garden 2. Second one. Sacrifice, sacrifice, sacrifice. After sacrifice, one receives. And after that, the spirit triumph. Each person has a purpose. I provide a gateway that is suitable to the person's spirit. And through it, the seeker can enter into a transformed world where the mind is at home in every land. The spirit learns to fly when sorrow sharpens its eyesight. The ray of awareness of the infinite illumines the blessings are sent. There is the path of earth and the path of wings. Figure it out and apportion your share. New Era Community One must know the process of battle called the casting down of the rocks. When the battle reaches a certain tension, the leader turns away portions of the aura and casts them at the borders of enemies. Agni Yoga. Astrochemistry makes it possible to determine the best combinations of astrochemical rays for each organism, 
astrology is nothing but formulas of astrochemistry he who enters a house permitted with the nicotine will carry away with him poisonous particles very very important sentences of each book Infinity number one. Accept in spirit the concept of infinity. Affirm infinity in your consciousness. Apply all thought on a broad scale. This lever of the fire of space is manifested everywhere. Throughout the limitless consciousness. the hand of the lord acts apply likewise you are striving where does the fire of infinity not live where does the fire of infinity not live infinity second part it may be said that cosmos is in a perpetual state of fiery transmutation the law and the motion are established by reciprocal attraction each energy attracted to the striving seed produces the effect each energy attracted to the striving seed produces its effect these effects enwrap the entire planet certainly the discovered law of electricity is connected with the fire of space hierarchy <laughs> the heart of an arhat is like the heart of cosmos the heart of an arhat is like the heart of cosmos the heart of an arhat is the fire of the sun eternity and the motion of cosmos fill the heart of the arhat maitreya is coming radiant with all fires his heart is aflame with compassion for destitute humanity his heart is aflame with the affirmation of the new covenants heart the heart is a temple the heart is a temple but not a hall of idols so while we have nothing against the construction of a temple fetishism or bazaars are unacceptable to us likewise when we talk about building a temple in the form of a heart we do not have a mind a heart shaped building we are indicating the temples inner significance temples inner significance theory world part 1 the human eye does not see the most powerful electric vibrations the same is true with regard to theory gradations incidentally the circumstance always hinders the reaching of fire theory world second part agni yoga requires a special resourcefulness agni yoga requires a special resourcefulness it cannot manifest through physical mechanics which appear in different degrees in other yoga such an element as fire should it would seem be subject to physical laws no less than other elements but the essence of agni is subject to such very subtle laws that physically it is inexpressible fiery world third part 
as the highest humility and the highest self renunciation should one accept the image of those bearing the full chalice of self sacrifice self sacrifice they carry a heavy burden in the heart they bear the brunt of the tension manifested by humanity they carry the burden of the entire discrepancy such humility is redemption who will give himself wholly to the achievement of drinking the cup of poison who will give himself wholly to the achievement of drinking the cup of poison om om why say om when it is possible to say prayer in such in substance they are the same but because of its antiquity and refinement the sound of the sound om will be stronger in its vibration om 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 let the resonance of the highest concept be pondered deeply the word itself is vibration such resonances are needed for the harmony of space great spiritual toilers pray not for themselves brotherhood brotherhood must be looked upon as an institution wherein the members work not by day but by the task one must love the labor in order to prefer the task work it must be realized that the tasks are infinite and the process of perfectment is also unending whoever is afraid cannot grow to love labor super mundane uruswati knows our voices both spoken and silent one may wonder about the differences in transmission there are many reasons beyond earthly conditions for these differences namaste thank you all to the technical team to the participants of the international congress to the conduct uh, people to all the team namaste from india namaste to all namaste gospodin kishore ogromne spasibo dear kishore thank you very much for your speech and uh, your insight of elena from the blavatsky's work of agni yoga are very similar uh, to uh, what have defined during the last 30 years the understanding of theosophy the it is agni yoga that is the culmination of the teaching of mahatma ishit for the entire third millennium it is very important and timely to remind all of us about the difficulties of overcoming the inertia of habitual thinking and uh, it is of a common by the knowledge it is the study of the secret doctrine and agni yoga as a single source that allows you to keep up with the time and always remain in you thank you very much uh, dear kishore for your message and for your words 